welcome to the channel english with nayar you see dear children we found that the students are also getting bored sitting at home so i would like to give some tips how to engage themselves during this covid pandemic times so please watch the video till the end this is an address to all the students who are at home with this pandemic and feeling a bit a bit depressed for not coming to school and having their daily study covid care and motivation to students covid 19 has made the world adaptive to digital learning the students staying at home nowadays and they are not going to school should do the following number 1 wash or sanitize the hands and wear a mask students need to wear mask even if they are meeting the society friends they should wash the hands and sanitize if they met the neighbor friends or gone out to purchase anything now you know the students are thinking that if they meet their friends the next door they need not wear masks but it's very risky they should wear the mask even if they met or meeting their building friends the flat friends or the friend next door they should wash their hands after coming to their respective homes if they have gone out to purchase anything then also they should wear a mask and on returning home they should sanitize or wash their hands so these two things should be done by the students that they should wear the mask even when they meet their society friends the flat friends or the building friends the neighbor friends they should get themselves sanitized regularly even if they are going to shop nearby they should do the same procedure so that is the first and the most priority to be taken up by the students who are at home away from the school second point make a daily routine time table in order to utilize the time properly students should make the daily routine time table wherein they ought to include yoga exercise or indoor games too this time table should have time for the hobbies as well now when they are at home they should make a time table they should not waste away the time that is the time should be utilized properly so they can make a daily day to day routine time table wherein they can include some sports activity like indoor games or do some exercise or yoga this will make them energetic and away from boredom the time table should also have some hobbies that they are interested in some past time activities the leisure time activities that could be done by them which gives them enjoyment and is not for school or college purpose so they should make a time table where apart from study they can include some exercise or they include some hobbies third point is refrain from eating junk food or overeating students should not engage in overeating as they are at home and are doing less physical work nowadays most of the kids or youths they engage eating junk foods or maybe they eat oily food at home during these times so they should refrain or stop themselves from eating such junk foods or fried foods similarly they should not be overeating now and then because at home you feel more hungry there are chances that you eat frequently so see that you don't overeat because nowadays you are doing less physical work as you are not going to schools and colleges so refrain from eating junk food or overeating the fourth point is the fourth tip that you have to take care 
and pay importance is that you have to engage yourself in online learning meticulously. Students should sincerely learn online the course study material apart from taught by teachers. They should sincerely ingrain study material as ultimately is knowledge that counts and not only mass to get success in real life. Now, uh, days the schools or the colleges are uh, conducting online classes for the students. The students should sincerely learn those and they should try to get study material from the website, from the internet, apart from what is given by the teachers. So they should use maximum time in surfing the net for their course material. They can also do some extra study that is uh, some of the courses, crash courses, some of the certificate courses that has been declared by the education ministry and they try to get more certificates. But at the end of the day, they should also understand that is knowledge that counts and not the certificate and marks. So they should try to get proper knowledge. They should have thirst for knowledge and try to get it from the website, from the digital courses and certificates. Because ultimately is the knowledge that counts in real life, the application of the knowledge to get success in the future life ahead. Last but not the least is help the parents and socialize online. Students should help their elder brothers and sisters or their father and mother in the daily household chores to get a break from the study. It helps to avoid depression and boredom in the pandemic times. Now, it's not necessary they always sit with book in their hands or always sit in the, uh, on the laptop and uh, computers and mobiles, but they can also help their elder brothers in some project or assignments or sisters for that matter. Similarly, they can help their father in the cleaning of the vehicle or any other work that is doing. They can help their mothers in the daily household chores, especially if it's a girl student. To get a break from the studies, this will help them to create a rapport uh, with their family members and to avoid depression and boredom in this pandemic time. So, students, you got all the five points that uh, I've explained here that will make you avoid depression or frustration in this pandemic time, make you stay safe and healthy. So all the best for this academic year too and till it has been declared by the government to open the schools and colleges uh, offline, you have to keep yourself engaged online study only, the digital study a revolution that has come up during this pandemic time throughout the world and we have to adapt that but we have to see to that that it is used properly in the true sense and we keep ourselves also engrossed in some other activities that makes us away from boredom, ennui and depression. It's a good day. Stay safe. Stay healthy.